Hello and welcome. Uh, Ingo is here from Carmen and Ingo Photography. Uh, we're talking to you in a short video today about a new feature which comes with all the Lightroom presets we have, like the version 1 and version 2 and the toolkit as well. So we have put together ACR Adobe Camera Raw presets out of those presets because not everybody is using Lightroom and so we thought we make them available for those who are using Bridge and Photoshop together with RAW files and um, the Adobe Camera Raw as well. So they are now included into the purchase and for those of you who have purchased already uh, drop us a message and we will be sending them to you as well if you need them. I mean we don't use Camera Raw but if you do they look the same as they are here in Lightroom, uh, but you cannot copy paste them into Adobe Camera Raw. So you need to convert them and we did that for you. So here they are, you can download them like all the three packages, um, Toolkit, Volume 2 and 1.1. So, and you need to copy them to where Adobe Camera Raw has its files. And um, with Command T, you open a new uh, window here and then you go above in the menu to it's called here Gien Tzu which is like go to and uh, if you click there and you uh, press the key alt it shows the hidden uh, folder library see that okay and uh, yeah you go there we need only here the application support thing so application support open it obviously we need Adobe and we go further to camera raw up there there is a folder settings in there and we have to place all those um, those files into the folder settings what we want to use in Adobe Camera Raw. Be aware that I mean you can use all the, the tools in there but uh, since there aren't folders like in Lightroom um, it can get a little bit messy so you need to decide whether you use only 2.0 or 1.1 or you know drop them back and forth maybe but uh, it gets pretty complicated I mean these these from 1.1 if you put them in there they will be mixed up with the alphabetic order of the other ones so okay we have here now um, to sh we have here a couple of shots raw files um, what where we're going to show you in Photoshop how this works so you move them there it opens Photoshop but not immediately First of all, as a Photoshop user, you know it's opening Camera Raw. And on the left side, we have a couple of thumbnails, and there is this um, the, the, the editing module for Camera Raw, which is actually the same uh, algorithm as the develop module in Lightroom. So there are similar names. This is again a German version, but you know you will find your your uh, buttons what you need. It's everything same uh, in English, but just a little different name. And well, we we don't go into the details with the whole surface here and explaining every tool. But here yeah, the 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 second right from the right here are the presets we copied in there. I copied one more previously from um, the the tool reset all because you can go and like click on one um, on one preset and it immediately shows it but you want to go back and there is no such reset button here uh, at the first place you need to press alt to make it um, visible and uh, if you don't want that or you don't know that so here's the tip uh, use candy tool reset all and you can like test and and you know go back and forth with uh, some tests of presets like this this was obviously love in the in the video we did for Lightroom and we to make it transparent and show you that it's all the same we use it here as well so one click boom it's done and here this one is actually I think color artsy um, yeah we did that before and we have a couple of things going on here the, the 70s candy 70s and uh, this color pop here and then you know you name it you walk through and click and and and, and look uh, what you like for your preset this was actually I think black and white hard and remember it was a little bit too dark in the darker area so go to the blacks and put them back a little bit and uh, you have the same um, things possible to change and do like you can in Lightroom. So this was black and white artsy for example and it all looks the same because it's it's the same same thing 
And um, you have normally, if you have used five, six files to do that, and 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 not like a whole bunch, otherwise it would work with Lightroom. Uh, so this was the the moody thing, candy moody. And um, well, this is one one favorite shot we had with the uh, black and white heart. And and if I want to open the picture now in in, in Photoshop or open all whatever, um, for example. I'm I'm doing a little cropping here as well again. If you want to open it now after you have um after you have set your your basic work in ACR, you open that picture and yeah, don't convert to sRGB. And then here you are in Photoshop with that picture and do whatever you want to do in Photoshop. Yeah, this is it. I hope it helps. And um, as said already, those ACRs are now in all of our Lightroom presets to download. And uh, we hope it helps and you have fun with the presets, enjoying yourselves. And maybe stop by on our Facebook page and say hi or on the blog. Uh, we're looking forward to hearing from you. Goodbye.